We've just arrived in Ljubljana, the capital of Slovenia, and we're just going to have a little look around the city and then a bit later we're going to get some dinner. Very cool looking building by there, I have to say. I love the colours and like the patterns on like the windows. Very cool though. All the other buildings are like a whitish colour. And then you have this bright orange colour one. Terracotta, I would say. Terracotta. <laughs> but there is, um, what's this, a church, isn't it? Uh, yeah, I think it's a pink church. Pink, I don't think it's very pink. I'd say that's also terracotta. <laughs> Mate, terracotta I am, is a I am the Pantone pink. of travel vloggers. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> that is the stupidest thing I've ever said. So oh this god. is the pink, apparently, church. I would say. It's a hundred. You think it's pink? It's pink. It's not pink. I think it's more of an orangey colour. Okay, so this orangey is the part where, colour. where we announced that ha Hannah's going to get colour blind. I, yeah, this isn't the first time I've been told I'm colour blind. Let me know in the comments what colour you think it is. If you think it's pink, it's probably just coming up different on camera. Mm, um, or it's because it's pink. Also, it might be a bit offensive because they're literally called pink chalk. <laughs> Whoa! So this is like the main square, is it? It doesn't look very square, as well. <laughs> the main, the main circle. Yeah. Oh, this is that. Um, oh, I love it when people play those instruments. Like three bridge something. <laughs> three bridge something. Yeah, like look, you see there. There's like three bridges that go across like at the exact same time. Oh yeah. Oh, I seen you yeah, about this. That, I don't know the name, but I seen this on Danigo and Stacey's thing video. Oh, these buildings look so pretty. So here, there are three bridges that... Oh, do you want to explain it, Steve? Explain uh, it's three bridges that, <laughs> that go across at the same time. Okay. So, there's the one. We're on this one. And then there's one just by there as well. I just absolutely love cobbled streets. I think it's the cutest thing ever. I love finding cities like this. Do you just have a very outrageous claim? Am I allowed to announce it? Yeah, go on, you can. I'm not, sure yet, I'm not like sure. Said, it might be my favourite ever city that I've visited so far. That's a like pretty big Europe. claim, yeah. So, I mean, it is very beautiful. Absolutely stunning. So it's now the next morning. Um, last night we went for dinner and it was really nice. Um, we realised it's not like that touristy here, um, but it was still quite lively, like for a Tuesday night. Yeah, it was, it was literally rammed. Yeah. Like every like bar had like pretty much like full yeah. capacity of like, like, people outside and stuff. Like there was lots of like restaurants and bars along like the main like river um, and it was like really lively so it was quite nice wasn't it? Um, but Steve was just saying what, why it's his famous, why it's actually his favourite city that I've been to now. True. Um, it's like a lot. I look at the market. Oh yeah. Oh, well, we're going there. Um, yes, yeah, so like m most cities have like their like new city and stuff, and then like their old town, which is just like a small like square or something. But this one, it's like the whole city is like the old town, and like yeah. it's just mixed in with the new. Like it has all like the nightlife and. Yeah. Stuff that looks proper nice vibe and like really nice yeah. buildings and stuff. It's proper cool. Yeah, I think if you you like the going to bars and stuff, you definitely like it here as well. Um, but like we all the restaurants and bars. Joe where would be happy. <laughs> his cousin Joe likes that, that stuff. Um, should we go to the market now then? Yeah. Have a little wander. We don't need to look around you. I doubt we're gonna buy any fruit and veg. And if we did. <laughs> Imagine! Get some broccoli for the journey. The size of the melon. So we're currently at Dragon Bridge, just right near the market over there. Um, and this is apparently what Ljubljana is most famous for. The Dragon Bridge. Apparently it's maybe some sort of materials for the first time or something. Um, but yeah, this is the bridge. Okay, so up there is where we're going to go up to the castle. I don't know if you can see. But the, what is the thing like, called? But, kind of like a cable car, but I'm yeah, sure they're called something so when they go up. We're going up this thing here up to the castle. So we've been walking up this for what feels like two hours. 
been about five minutes. It's not that bad really, but um, we're worrying now that we took the walking route instead of that cable car thing that we actually wanted to do, which is fine. I like a bit of a walk, but this one is actually his car at football. So and there's a lot of hikes we're gonna be doing at like the end of our journey. So we really need to like save his legs for them. And this is not gonna be good for it, but otherwise it's quite a nice walk. <laughs> I'm trying to hide that amount of breath from my voice. Hope you can't hear me panting, but I've just made it to this point now. You can kind of see the castle poking over the top. Little sign. So we're almost there. That really wasn't that much of a long walk actually, was it? No. Oh look, you're doing two at a time, you little show off. Oh, look at you go. Oh wow, how pretty is this? Really nice. I don't know which way to look. We've got a beautiful castle on this side. And then this view. Wow. So this statue is a monument to peasant uprising. I love like all of the detail. This is another lovely view by the castle. Views upon views. So up one of these alleyways is this drain and it has lots of these, there's 700 of these bronze faces in them. I wonder what it's for. Oh look at this one, Steve, pulling this thing out. <laughs> So we're just about to go into the House of Illusions now, so it should be good. Is it like a museum sort of thing, is it? Um, I think so. It's like illusions and that. But Don't I'm really know what bit, to expect. I'm a little bit nervous <laughs> because I get quite seasick and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I think you'll be fine. Oh, masks. Oh yeah, okay. okay so if I look at some feet seconds, you count feet seconds to let me know what it's Go on. Okay, while we're waiting for Hannah to do that, I'm going to show you this view. The castle. Should I look now? Yeah. What an animal, nothing's changed. I don't know, so much happened. She beat the illusion. Oh, actually, I can still see it. Like, in, it's like the floor's patterned, so it's really. If I look up to the sky, I can still see the swirls, but. <laughs> and literally, all I would see is stars and feel like very sick, so I'm gonna give that one a miss. So she hasn't seen this picture before, but I have. So do you see an old lady or a young lady? An old lady. Do you? Yeah. Um, I can see both because I know them both. Because if you look, if there's the eyelash and there's the nose and there's the cheek and the chin, it's a woman look, looking away like that. Oh, yeah. And that's like her ear. Oh, yeah. And then the old lady, like, that's her big nose and the chin and the eye. Body up in here. Oh, because you didn't close We took the way out! Oh my god! Right, spin around ten times and see. Okay. I don't want to lock myself in. Alright. Not in. Oh, that isn't nice. Ooh. I'll see if you can get a cool picture in here. Okay, so here, press the button. Do you know these nails come up? Apparently you meant to lie. <laughs> you meant to lie on it and press the button, but I can't imagine it being very hard. I mean, they aren't really hard and they're comfortable. Okay, so, I'm going to go back. You lie down. Shall so I press the button? Surely it's really going to hurt. Oh my god! Does it hit? It's really hard. So weird. Can you be doing me It's yeah. like really, it doesn't hurt so comfortable. I'm scared. Ow! Oh, it's not. It's like a floating tap. So <laughs> You okay there? <laughs> 
Can you see inside the box? Yeah. <laughs> Come on. What? Oh, <laughs> you go. <laughs> you can't put your hands through the railings though it's there. Oh, I'm scared. Oh my god, I mean oh, I'm, so I can't do it. Oh my god, Steve! I can't! I'm falling off! Oh. Are we moving? I can't! It's so quick. Wait, we're still! I can't understand <laughs> this! I feel like I'm spinning around <laughs> I'm gonna fall off! Oh my god, Steve! That is literally so weird. Does it show how I can it show I can't. What? I'm falling this way now! <laughs> Yeah, it's literally so still. <laughs> oh my god. Are we gonna go shut down? I feel like... <laughs> <laughs> is this picking it up? I don't think this is picking it up. I find this really interesting. Um, so they've just... Uh, the contrast on this one is the same, like, the same nose, same mouth, same eyes, but this one looks like a, more like a man and this one looks like a woman, just from that. Isn't that interesting? Hey, Oh, Steve. Oh, thank you. Mm. So we've just come out of the House of Illusion and it was so good, wasn't it? That was way better than I thought it was going to be. It was loads Very of fun. Good. We could have spent a lot more time in there if you wanted to. Okay. Um, the last bit was the best bit, wasn't it? There's like this room where like the walls are like moving and the bridge is still. Well, the wall is moving, so the lights are. Isn't it? No, it's like a it's like um. Was it actually moving? Yeah, it's like a it's circle that's going round. Right. It no, it's like a tunnel that oh. spins round. Right. Oh my god, but it made you feel like you were moving out. I was literally like clinging onto the railings. I was like dead still, but it felt like I was going to fall off. It was so funny, wasn't it? Yeah, it was hilarious. It was good, and you get a slush puppy as well. So, which is really nice because it's so warm today. Beautiful day. I think it's like 27 today, isn't it? Mm-hmm. It was lovely. Right. Yeah. Should we go to the next place? Yeah! They have a Love Lock bridge here. That'd be cute. So that wraps up our time in Ljubljana. I'm going to miss saying that word, are you? Ljubljana. Ljubljana. Yeah. I'm probably going to be saying it low, just because how much I'm going to recommend it to everyone. Yeah, we've really enjoyed it here. We can see why a lot of people describe it as like the most underrated city in Europe. I, I can confirm it is definitely my favourite city that we've been to yeah. as well. Just like on the overall experience. Yeah. It's got like such a cool vibe. Really like seeing it in Korea. Like, 100%. Quite a lot to do here as well. And it's all like quite compact, like quite close, you know, to do quite a lot, yeah. not too much walking. So we're quite sad to leave this a beautiful city, but not too sad because we're off somewhere very exciting next. So please make sure you like and subscribe. Oh, I've gone the wrong way. Again. <laughs> right, Again. Got okay, right. sorry. As I was saying, make sure you like and subscribe so you can follow us to see where we're going next on our Slovenian road trip. Which features a birthday surprise for Hannah. <laughs> See you soon. Bye. Whoa! I forgot what you got here. Absolutely unreal.